for his second time in as many years, Garrett Stocks. These I'm not getting that well. These I hadn't got very well because they're too vast. The big ones. <laughs> Stay put. So all you hear is Cody FaceTime his girlfriend, 
he comes in with a very feminine voice, which is odd to hear from such a large man. <laughs> we did that for a lot longer than we should have because we had to wrestle the next day. <laughs> but uh, that's just one of the times where he really lights the mood and brings the guys up for wrestling. Oh, Jesus. Uh, 
Angie has a superpower. She can make a loaf of peanut butter and jelly sandwiches <laughs> and put it on menu. <laughs> With extra peanut butter and extra jelly. <laughs> she makes sure that she has it because she says, go pick him up. I'll be there in a half hour. And she always comes with a totally like a baby. So. <laughs> kids don't like peanut butter and jelly. It's her fault. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Go hand from those special boards, and Jesse. Don't drop right, it. So um, I know everyone wants to go home and everything. Don't but, drop um, it. I really haven't introduced, you know. <laughs> we haven't really um, thanked the coaches enough. We've really done and everything. And um, all the coaches have really made me feel like I've had that. And, um, yeah, you can jump in if you want. <laughs> oh, yeah. Um, like Coach Sexton, when I first started wrestling, you know, I didn't have a dad, and I was lonely and stuff, and he made me fight for everything, and Coach Mann, too, he made me laugh, have joy. Coach Basin, Coach Winnicola, y'all both let me fight, help me fight and stuff. And um, my mom, they, she bought um, a lot of stuff for y'all. So I did. It's just like... Um, Not a public so speaker. And I really hope I can come back and see y'all again. So um, can y'all give it up for the coaches? Open it at the top, Jim. Open it from the top, yeah. stepping up and saying something about it. Um, so these young men have definitely come together um, and I've seen them support each other, go through tough times with each other, uh, kind of be the counselors for each other, uh, all that kind of stuff. So I just absolutely enjoy and love coaching these young men uh, and they have been a blessing to me uh, more than I've been a, I feel like I've been a blessing to them. Uh, so I just really Appreciate all you've done, parents. Thanks for the sacrifice from you, uh, getting them here uh, and pushing them and supporting them. And I apologize again for whatever it was that we caught that we sent home to you guys. Uh, my goal is to never let that happen again, but I guess it's kind of part of it. But thank you for dealing with it and, and working through it. Uh, Thank you so much. Uh, we will have that meeting at Coach Man uh, about financing right after. Um, moving on from this point, uh, this is kind of the closing of things. Um, we do have youth practice, and youth practice goes from elementary school age uh, all the way up through high school. Uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, uh, 6 to 8. So every one of you guys can be involved, uh, and you know, I, I, to build our program, to take it to the next level, we need to have more involvement with club. 
Okay, um, I've seen how it's grown other programs, and that's why uh, I have a wonderful opportunity from uh, a college teammate of mine. Uh, he wants to start and continue to have the youth program here. Uh, and his name is Derek Harris. Uh, there's very little commitment that you need to have to it. Uh, to be involved, you can come to practices, and all you have to do, your parents have to sign the waiver. That's it. Uh, it's not mandatory that you be there every week or every day, uh, but the more off-season training we can do, the better. There are off-season tournaments, and if you want to go to one of those, we'll get you to one, we'll find you one. I mean, Foot Face has been through the circuit, and he knows when tournaments are coming around, which ones to go to, all that kind of stuff. But we really need more involvement uh, in this summer training and, and workout program. Uh, Coach Bates is going to also work the guys out over the offseason, and then they'll actually have some mat time as well. So there's a lot of opportunity that we need to take advantage of to take this thing to the next level. Uh, so we really need to work on that. Uh, but... Again, I just appreciate everything you guys have done, all the sacrifices that you've made. Uh, and you know, every one of these guys has a have a spot in my heart uh, for the rest of my life. Appreciate you so much. Thank you.